Hi, I'm Mike Brown and with the famous Grouse, I'm looking back at the 2021 Premiership season. My game of the Gallagher Premiership 2021 season is Harlequins versus Bristol in the playoff semi-final. I was there watching the game and it was an incredible game to watch. First half, Bristol were all over the Harlequins team, taking a 28 nil lead, I think it was, right up to half time where we managed to, to steal a try back. The Harlequins looked dead and buried, but coming into the second half, they scored very quickly and then Bristol just looked out on their feet and Quinns just grew into the game with their counter-attack ability, their turnover. It started living off the scraps of the Bristol team to fight back. It went into extra time, 100 minutes of end-to-end -end rugby, um, some unbelievable tries, some unbelievable performances for both teams. Um, but Harlequins came out winners in that, uh, in that um, extra time um, to make the final. For Harlequins at half time, I think the team talk would have been very much led by that spine of the team, the leaders of the team, the Joe Marlers, the Danny Cares, the captain, Steph Stefan Luis, who's been brilliant all season as, as a captain, Marcus Smith, even though he's a, a young lad, he's our quarterback, he would have been leading that, that team talk in, in the attack sense. The general message would have been stick to what we're good at, stick to the way Harlequins play, which has stood us in good for, for the majority of the season and got us to that point. Of, of reaching the top four and into that semi-final. So those would have been the messages and that was what we saw coming out into that second half. Queens went back to what they're good at, getting turnovers and, and really stinging teams off turnovers. We knew going into the game that, that Bristol were actually top of the league for, for points scored against off turnovers. On the other side, Harlequins are, are top of points scored off turnovers. So we knew that going into the game and we really lived off that in that, in that um, second half.